<laughs> G'day guys, thanks again for coming along for the latest market update. Uh, it's flown by, so yeah, any questions, far away. Uh, Shane, how's the market in Gosnells currently? Look, it uh, depends if you're a buyer or seller. If you're a buyer, fantastic. There's awesome opportunities out there. As I said last time, first home buyers, great opportunities. Uh, if you're buying and selling the same market, a lot of smart buyers are realising that areas like Canning Vale could never be more affordable, stuff under 500. It's been a while since that's the case. So buying and selling the same market, great opportunities. Uh, if you don't need to sell, obviously it is tough overall. So you can wait it out and look for hopefully an improvement another 12, 18 months uh, when things settle down a bit. So have prices stabilised? They have stabilised. Uh, you'll see statistically it's down to 283. The median house price in Gosnells was 300 late last year. But that's mainly due to a lot of those larger developments that went to market late last year and early in the year that haven't sold yet. Um, and also vacant land. Vacant land's been really tough just because established is so affordable at the moment. Have average days on market uh, blown out or have they pulled back? They've stayed the same. It's a really good question you ask that because it's staying at 90 at the moment, but I think it's not a true indication because when you change agents, which is quite often the case, it does start the clock again. So I think a true guide would be about 150, but statistically it's sitting at 90. As is 37, so kicking some goals. So Shane, recently we're seeing meeting with Aaron Sandland in Gosnells. Any truth behind the rumour? Could he be in the blue and gold next year? You have very good sources. I did have a meeting with Aaron Sandlands, but unfortunately not. He's got plenty of uh, life left in the legs. But an even bigger star is coming to Perth in June. Uh, Shannon Noel, massive social media following. He's playing at the Gosnells Hotel. So if the locals are going to get behind that, make sure you get down there. Uh, Shane, how's the rental market? Uh, another good question. Rental market definitely has turned the corner. Much more positivity out there. Um, if you are looking to, as a tenant, I would say I'd go to my property manager, maybe lock in a rate. A lot of people moving back from over east with, I guess, more, more mining and what have you uh, up north. So you're starting to see a lot more rentals go quickly because they can't buy it because they're changing jobs and what have you. So if you can lock in the rate uh, before you get a tap on the shoulder of the property manager, it's a good idea. And for landlords, there's better times ahead. I think it's fair to say you'll see that in the media also. Any other questions? Or? Well, thanks again, guys. Any other questions, be sure to hit me up. You don't have to wait for the end of the quarter. I'm all ears all the time. Yeah, love to hear any feedback if you need anything. Thanks again.